Camera Nail Art Tutorial by Hot Pink Zebra Polish. Begin by painting all of your nails a medium to a dark gray. On your ring and thumbnail with black paint, we're going to be painting the basic shape of a camera. So starting in the middle of your nail, you're going to want to paint a large black rectangle. And you want the corners of your rectangle to be nice and rounded so they don't look very harsh or sharp looking. So then once you've got the shape of your camera nice and smooth, right in the middle on top of that camera, we're going to be painting another black segment. So then with lighter gray paint, we're going to be painting a nice large circle in the middle of the camera. And then above that circle, just paint a little dashed line. So now in the center of our circle, we're going to be painting a smaller black circle. So this will just be leaving a thin gray outline. And now we're just going to add a few white highlights. So then on our middle and pinky nail, we're going to be painting a thick black line across the middle of our nail. And with this design, you can paint our line either vertically or horizontally. So I did it both ways. That way you can see which you prefer. And now we're going to be painting a stripe of rectangles in the middle of our black stripe. And you want to leave a thick line on both the top and the bottom of these rectangles because we're going to be adding a dashed line in just a moment. So paint that first rectangle somewhere in the middle of the line and then add more rectangles off to each side. So then, as I mentioned, in those lines both above and below our rectangles, just add a dashed line with the gray paint we've been using. And then on our pointer nail, we're going to start by painting a stripe down the middle with white polish. And then we're going to be painting the word smile on our white stripe, so starting in the middle of your nail with the letter I. And then above the I, we're going to continue with the letter M and then S. And I would just like to apologize at this point. I'm using my left hand to do this design, and so that is not my dominant hand. So my designs got a little bit, a little bit funky, but you know, it's all a learning experience. And I hope that the fact that I'm using my left hand will actually help you in your troubles with your non-dominant hands. So then on your stripe, we're going to be outlining that with black lines on either side. And of course, add a layer of top coat. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you like my design. Please comment with requests and subscribe. Also, check me out on Facebook and Twitter. I will see you in my next video.